opening span task. And first, there will be teaching trials with cards, and then there will be testing trials without cards. Uh, before beginning this task, it's important to make sure that the cards are in order. And right now, the last card is first, if you can see the little 24 there. If not, just know that when you give this task, it's much easier if they're in the opposite order. So I'm going to do that real quick, where they're face down, and card 1 is on the top, and then they go up until card 24. Okay. When I look up at the camera, I'm not the examiner, I'm addressing you. And when I look here at Amber, that's when I am being the examiner. Now we'll play a game with pictures. Are you ready? Yes. Ball. Car. Tell me the last word. Car. That's right. Let's try another one. Bus. Dog. Tell me the last word. Dog. That's right. Let's try another one. Now I'm going to ask you a question and show you some more pictures. Answer the question and then say the last word. Ready? Are apples red? Yes. Tell me the last word. Apples red. Almost. I asked, are apples red? So the last word is red. Let's try again. Practice items can be administered a total of two times. She got it wrong the first time, so I will administer it again. If she gets it wrong again, I will read the answer to her, but I will not administer the task a third time. Ready? Yes. Are apples red? Yes. Tell me the last word. Red. That's right. I asked are apples red, so the last word is red. Let's do some more. Answer the first question and then tell me the last word. Are dogs blue? Blue. Almost. You told me the last word. But first, say yes or no. Let's try again. Are dogs blue? Yes. Tell me the last word. Blue. That's right. I asked our dogs blue. So the last word is blue. Let's try another one. Ready? Mm -hmm. Do balls bounce? Yes. Tell me the last word. Balls bounce. Almost. Remember, I said do balls bounce. So the last word is bounce. Let's try again. Do balls bounce? Yes. Tell me the last word. Balls bounce. Almost. Remember, I said do balls bounce. So the last word is bounce. I've already administered this trial twice, so I do not administer it again. Let's do some more without pictures. Are you ready? Before each trial, make sure the child is looking at you, because the items cannot be repeated. If you ask the question and the child wasn't listening, you can't repeat it, and so they would not have a chance to complete that item. I'm sure I will have a chance to practice that today. Are you ready? Is candy yummy? Yeah, I really like candy. I had a bunch last Tell night. Tell me the last words. Candy yummy. Sometimes the child will try to tell you a story. Politely ignore the story and go on with the next question. Quickly they will learn the routine. Ready for the next one? Do frogs jump? If the child does not respond, prompt by saying yes or no. Yes or no? Yes. Tell me the last words. Jump. Can chairs walk? That's silly. If the child says something that's close enough to yes or no, like that's silly or of course, just circle whichever answer you think it's closest to and go on with the item. Tell me the last words. Chairs walk. Now I'm going to say two questions. Answer both questions and then tell me the last words. Ready? Are bananas yellow? Yes. Remember the last word. What is the last word? Yellow. Remember that. Are men purple? Oops. 
It's always important to make sure you have the cards in the right order. As I just demonstrated, if I give the purple card first, the item doesn't make very much sense. Are men purple? Yes, that one is. Tell me the last words. Men purple. Almost. I asked, are bananas yellow? Are men purple? So the last words are yellow, purple. Let's try again. When you pick the cards up to repeat the item, be careful to make sure they're in the right order. Ready? Are bananas yellow? Yes. Remember the last word. What is the last word? Yellow. Remember that. Are men purple? No. Tell me the last words. Yellow, purple. That's right. I asked are bananas yellow, are men purple, so the last words are yellow, purple. Let's try another one. Ready? Do dolls read? No. Remember the last word. There's less prompting on sample E than sample D. On sample D, I say, remember the last word. What is the last word? Wait for a response. Remember that. On sample E, I only say, remember the last word. Do boys run? Yes. Tell me the last words. Read, run. That's right. I asked, do dolls read, do boys run? So the last words are read, run. Let's do some more. Let's do some more without pictures. Are you ready? Look over here. Do beds jump? No. Do people work? Yeah, a lot of people work. My parents Tell me the work. last words. Um, people work. These responses only came from the last sentence, which is not in the box. So I will need to prompt by saying, what are the other ones? What are the other ones? Um, boys, chairs? Let's try another one. Can tables talk? No. Can lamps run? That's silly. That's close enough to no. Tell me the last words. Tables talk. Do spiders crawl? Uh-huh. Is ice cream cold? Yes. Tell me the last words. Um, beds jump? Those two words were not in the box. They were also not in the last sentence. So I do not prompt. I don't circle anything. I simply go on to the next item. Let's try some more. Are you ready? Do babies crawl? Mm hmm Remember the last word. What is the last word? Crawl. Remember that. Do bikes sleep? No. Remember the last word. Do monkeys dig? No. Tell me the last words. Crawl, dig, bikes, bed? Almost. Listen carefully. I asked, do babies crawl? Do bikes sleep? Do monkeys dig? So the last words are crawl, sleep, dig. Let's try again. Ready? Mm -hmm. Do babies crawl? Yes. What's the last word? Crawl. Remember that. Do bikes sleep? No. Remember the last word. Do monkeys dig? No. Tell me the last words. Crawl, sleep, dig. That's right! Let's try some more. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Do birds fly? Mm -hmm. Some do, not all. Do cats bark? No. Do people talk? Tell me the last words. Uh, cats bark and people talk. Let's try another one. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Do tigers roar? Mm -hmm. Do cats talk? Mm -hmm. 
Do boys play? Yes. Tell me the last words. Girls run, dolls read. Okay. Again, none of these answers came from the box, and none of them came from the last sentence, so I cannot prompt. I simply go on to the next item. Can trucks drink? Uh, yeah, gasoline. Can balloons pop? Yes. Can cars talk? Yes. Tell me the last words. Cars talk. Now I have to prompt because the only answers came from the sentence that is not in the box. When I prompt, I will write P, R, and circle it so that when the task is scored, everyone knows that I prompted correctly. What are the other words? Chuck's drink. Okay, let's try some more with even more questions. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Do pigs read? No. Do boats cry? No. Do buses eat? No. Do babies crawl? Yes. Tell me the last words. Babies, pigs, buses, boats. Ready? Mm -hmm. Are spoons sharp? No. Can cats meow? Yes. Here I made a small mistake. I said, can cats meow? But the test says, can cows meow? This doesn't make any difference until she gives her response. Can continue as usual, even though I said the wrong word, but now I have to remember if she says cat to circle it as correct. Try to practice enough that these mistakes don't happen. Are cups fast? No. Do girls play? Mm -hmm. Tell me the last words. Girls play. Cats meow and cups are fast. So I circled cows because I said cats instead of cows. Again, more practice would keep me from making this kind of mistake. Let's try another one. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Do dogs bark? Yes. Is school fun? Yes. Can toys break? Yes. Do shoes sleep? No. Tell me the last words. School's fun and dogs sleep. Okay, we're all done with that game. You did such a good job listening. <laughs>